welcome to Badger Tutorials, where I'm going to be showing you how to add face cams to your gameplay. So, you were like, hmm, I want to start a gaming channel and be like PewDiePie or Tobuscus or all those awesome people, right? So, I'm going to show you how you can do a little better at that using a program called Sony Movie Studio. Um, this program is not free, it does cost $50, but listen guys, I have looked all over the internet and I can't find a good movie program, movie editing program, that will help you add a face cam, alright? Windows Movie Maker is just not going to cut it, right? The, you can't do overlay, you can't do anything like that, so you need a program that's going to let you do overlay, and this is one of the better programs that I've found. Even though it costs $50, but think about it. I mean, that's just $50, and you can get so much farther in your videos if you have a face cam, I believe. Um, I mean, there are other YouTubers that will disagree with me there, but I, I just want, I want to share this video with you because I see a lot of people that really, really want to get into this gaming thing but can't because they they don't know how to do any of this stuff. So I'm gonna help you out. I hope you I hope you're alright with that. Let me remove this file right here. I don't need it. <clears throat> so when you open up Windows Movie Studio here and just you can use the the preset everything uh, that comes with it. Just hit OK, new project, right? Go into that, come up with this here. So you have your, your gameplay recorded already, right? You use Fraps or you use Bandicam. You recorded everything you needed to record. You even recorded your webcam at the same time, right? You got to record it at the same time with your gameplay. And then you have those two files saved somewhere. And I usually like to tag my files as like um, gameplay one and... Uh, webcam one or something like that just so you know what you're, you're going to use together now I'm going to use uh, just like a test game and then a test um, audio it's not going to match up at all but I just want to show you how to add these to your thing so here we go what you want to notice about this is that down here it says text Right, this is where you put your text overlays if you need them. Right? Down here it says video. Notice that there's only one thing for video. That's gonna have to change. Because we're gonna add an overlay onto the main video. So this is the main video. You wanna right click, hit insert video track. Alright, so you'll have a video track right there. That's good. We need this. If you want, you can right click. Uh, hit rename, maybe webcam. Just name it something like that. That'll be good. All right, but you you do need that. Now this one, this one right here is your overlay. You're going to be putting in a video to match that, right? Of course, here you have audio, you have music. If you want to add those to your videos, that should help you out a lot. All right. You're also going to need another audio track. This is for the webcam audio, right? Alright, so now, now that we have these layers set up, we can start inserting our media. So, here we go, let's add some media. And I'm going to use my, I saved these on my desktop. Right? So, I'm going to use my Vanish Play through right here. Notice it takes a little bit of time to build the peaks. That's the audio. They're building the audio. Let me take a drink here. Yeah, better. Right? We're going to add some media here. More desktop. I'm going to use this capture that I recorded just a, uh, a couple minutes ago. It's nothing special here. Proxy being built. That's okay. Just hit okay. All right. So now we have our two videos up. That's perfect. Okay. You want to take your vanish video 
or whatever video you have for your gameplay. If you want, you can rename this video and name it Gameplay. But whatever you want to be the main attention has to be in that video that they, they gave you first, right? It's not going to work any other way. Let's just put that right there. Notice I can hit Preview. I can move my cursor by doing that. Hit Preview. And it runs. It runs fine. That, this is your preview video, so you can see how your video looks in actual, you know, how it's going, right? Now what you want to do is take your webcam video, which I have right here, and place it into this spot right here where it says webcam. Right? I know it's, it's short, but <laughs> I'm just going to show you how to do this. Now listen, this video is going to push this other video over. And the reason is because these two audios are going to conflict with each other. Okay, and they don't want overlap. You can overlap them. Um, that's okay, it'll work, but th the program automatically tries to not overlap them. So what you want to do is click and just drag this over. Notice the little X on the audio track? That means they're overlapping. Okay. What I usually do is if I want to control the audio for both, um, I like to turn my webcam audio up and my video game audio down, right? So I'll move the audio track of one of them down to this other audio, right? Now notice this top video is going to take precedence over the bottom video. See that? So what you want to do is take this, <clears throat> you want to put it in the upper left hand corner, upper right hand corner, wherever you want to put it, right? What you want to hit is pan and crop. Pan and crop, I usually extend this a little bit here. Now what pan and crop does is it, this is your whole screen. This outer layer is what the video is going to be about, right? It's going to show that whole thing. So when you take and drag this, you're changing what is going to be seen. This is the overlay. So if you want that here, you can zoom out with your mouse wheel or however you do that in your, your screen, right? You want to put it in your upper left hand corner, you can move this, oops, you can move that wherever you want to put it, you can put it in your upper right hand corner, wherever you want your video to be, alright, now you don't have to hit anything, sorry about that, you don't have to hit anything, you just hit X, alright, notice my, my webcam changed positions. Okay. This is just a recording. Two. There you go. So that's how you do that. You can add other effects. You could fade. You could. You could do other stuff. Whatever you need to do. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Um, when you actually want to make your video, just hit Project Make Video. Uh, you can save it to your hard drive. You could upload it straight to YouTube. You can do anything like that, anything you want to do, and that should work out for you. Thank you for watching. Badger out.